Looking for the green like CeeLo But a cute down bitch is all I really need though Okay, I had some thick shit sliding on the D though But she was on the slick shit looking for a hero Not me though, so fresh and so clean though I can understand why you fuck with my Stilo Yeah, it's cool, got nothing on me though They tried to wear everything that glitter don't gleam though Backwood hitting like Debo, yeah, it's priceless. I do it for a fee, though. It's a movie and I'm Quentin Tarantino. Thought you did it big, it was all just a dream, though. Going dumb and I do it every day, doing me and I couldn't do it any other way. Shorty came with the cake and the maid, but I had to find me when the area was gray. Cause everything that glitter ain't gleaming. Told me that she loved What's going on, y'all? Thanks for tuning in to your favorite sneaker and boxing show. This is Sneaks and Geeks. I'm your host, Birdie, master optician by day, avid sneakerhead by night, the creator of this rug behind me, and the creative director of the show is Cameron. What's going on, bro? What's happening? Say what's happening. No. What's up? <laughs> they, don't know, they don't know about tip. They don't know. <laughs> tip. <laughs> if y'all are new to the show, thank you so much for tuning in. Before we get started, definitely tune in to 21 Pilots. That is our first series here on Sneaks and Geeks. 21 first episodes, you're gonna see us unbox fire kicks from one through 21. Check it out, then come back to us. Again, this is season one. We always unbox fire kicks here. Y'all see the box on the table. Before we unbox what's here, let's talk about what I wore today. Bam. And for those who have watched 21 Pilots, you already know what these are. Say hello and welcome back to the Adidas Yeezy Boost. 350 V2 in ash blue. Love this colorway. Y'all know I love Yeezys. Love, I mean, yeah, all the Yeezys, really. This colorway is so special. It's a one of one, okay? It was a pack, I think it was ash blue, ash red, and something else. Either way, enough about these comfortable shoes. Let's get back to the shoes on the table. Straight to it. Let's go right to it, bro. This is what a LeBron household. Is it not? Most definitely. Most definitely. Y'all see what it is. This is the Nike LeBron 8 Quick Strike. V1, actually, South Beach. Okay. Y'all see the ticket right here? Must mean a rapper win. And it was. Shout out to Unheard of Sound downstairs. Percy and all them gave me the uh, rapper win. So I really appreciate it. Always love. In fact, I got these a while ago. I got these July of 21. That's when they released. Finally get to unbox them with y'all, so it's very special. So, this is a re-release of LeBron's eighth signature shoe with Nike. Oh, and his first, oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, you not feeling like when you just like see something that you wanted and you never had before All and it's like time. here like what a year's for like that's exactly that's exactly what this is right here never had it as a kid but again this is lebron's first shoe with the heat hence why they call it south beach okay y'all see the details on the box beautiful that's on the wrapping paper as well you can't see that because it's kind of shiny but it's all good Let's close this, move it to the side, one or the other. Boom. Get right to the details, y'all. Look at this shoe. Look at this shoe. Oh my gosh. Y'all see this shoe? <laughs> Get right into it, y'all. So, filament green on the upper, okay? See the pink flash laces. Gorgeous touch. Some writing on the, the laces. I think it says eight for his eight signature shoes. Flywear technology in the upper. LJ23 right there. The full length air, or I guess, yeah, air bubble. Air Max bubble. So clean. One of my favorite parts right here. You see the pink flash uh, triangle with the line and the white eyes the best line on here is easily on the tongue can't you can't deny that at all let me just get this out the way can't deny that at all you see the details you see the gorgeous eyes the pink eyes my favorite overall 
detail on the shoe. This right here. Specify for LeBron James. Best part right here is 828. What does that stand for? So 828 stands for 82 regular season games and 28 playoff games. Because in the playoffs, there's seven games or up to seven games and four series. So makes sense. Maximum games. Everybody know LeBron went to the finals, what, 10, 10 years straight? Actually, ever since these came out, he went 10 years straight. First in 2010, and then he went all the way through 2020. I'm pretty... Yeah, he did, because he didn't go, like... He had a break in between there, yeah. So, he went straight, but yeah. Love how this shoe looks, y'all. Ah! These are initially released in October of 2010 for 160. The re-release, July 21st of 2021 for 200 hate to see it but i feel like all restocks and things like that always go up for price i don't know if y'all can see it right here it says witness in there yeah i mean it's, it's dark but this is uh such a clean shoe love the colorway so the init the well i should say the original color is retro slash black pink flash retro slash flash rose slash nor so i yeah that's i think that's the spanish colorway too <laughs> Like the English is Spanish by the way. Either way, y'all, uh, I was so happy to get these shoes. These are LeBron's eighth signature shoe with Nike, and then his second shoe designed by Jason Petrie. I'm talking about Jason Petrie because Jason Petrie is one of the legendary LeBron designers. Ever since starting with the LeBron Seven, he initially put the air bubble in there, and honestly, I think he had it from to, from the Seven all the way through the uh, Thirteen, all the way through. And it's such a legendary design, legendary colorway. When it initially released in 2010, um, the colorway was called Preheat just because it was before, because it released, uh, well, I guess right before the season, because the season started, I feel, feel like a week or two after, or before, excuse me, this shoe came out. Um, so I think that, <laughs> I think it's really cool that they re-released it. Um, if you want to get the original one, it's going for like $7,000 on StockX. I'm not paying that. Are you paying that? Mm. In fact, wait, don't you have these two? I do have them. Hey, we both oh. got the <laughs> I forgot all about that for real. Uh, Man, hey, no. I forgot all about that. Yeah, those. let's go. We both got these. So, you already know. Like I said, LeBron household. Cam agrees. You know what it is. Boom. Love these. If y'all like LeBrons like we do, uh, please comment. Let us know which LeBrons. If you're a new LeBron fan, an old LeBron fan, who's your GOAT? Obviously, LeBron James, but who's your GOAT? We won't judge. We won't, like, hate or anything, but we already know who the GOAT is. It's just a question. Um, so, let me know, guys. Let me know if you guys think LeBron's are more comfortable or if you think Jordan's are more comfortable. What's your favorite basketball shoe? Let us know. We keep it real organic here on Season Geeks, but we always appreciate y'all tuning in. This is your favorite sneaker unboxing show. Tune in next time for another fire unboxing pair of shoes, no matter what. Myself and Cam always have the fire. He, he mainly me. I mean... You do. T I mean, I want to say you don't, but like, that's not right. Took it back. Yeah, so good. <laughs> nah, I got, <laughs> I got heat. It's yeah, you got heat. You got heat. He been had heat too for a. Hey, ben had heat. Paris heat. Don't know about that, bro. We'll know. see y'all next time. <laughs>